Hey guys, it's Nicole, and sorry I'm like kind of like slouching a little bit, and if you didn't realize, I'm in a different location. Not like a different location, because I'm in my bedroom still. Sorry about that. Um, I just had to pull this on up. If you can see back in that direction, that direction, yes, <laughs> um, that is where... I have usually film, but now I'm filming right now at this moment in front of the window because I feel like it. I feel like window filming today. But anyway, today I'm going to do a Context 101 video, and I think this was requested by XOXOASSH, or maybe it was O X O X O. A S H H H. I'm not sure, but it'll be right here, guys. Right here. Wow. Starting off for contacts. Sorry, some random person was in our yard. Random person in our yard. <laughs> They're such a creep. Look at me creeping. We'd be creeping Nicole's way. Okay, so for contacts. Um, so I'm just going to start off about, like, about my story with contacts and glasses. Um, so when I was younger, um, I had to get glasses, obviously, first, because I was probably in, I was in the fourth grade, I believe, and I started off with these gross, 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 icky glasses, and, because my mom picked them out, she thought they were in style, you know, really... <laughs> Nicole, they were in style. You don't know what you're talking about. <laughs> so, yeah. Then I learned, do not listen to your mother. Actually, listen to your mother about some stuff. Unless she's stupid like mine, well then, don't listen to her. I'm just joking, just joking. I love you, Mom. So, I got glasses when I was in the fourth grade. Um, and... Yeah, and then I had them up until the 7th grade when I wanted to get contacts because in the 6th grade I refused to wear my glasses. I was like, I look like a nerd and I'm not going to look like a nerd wearing glasses in the 6th grade. <laughs> you know what I mean? My mom took me to the eye doctor and she got me some contacts. And I forgot to bring my contacts out here, but I, I use the Accuve kind. And these are easier for like me on my eyes, cause, like, because I sleep with my contacts in, and by the way, you do not sleep with your contacts in if you wear contacts, you got me? Yes, okay. Why you don't sleep with your contacts in? Because you will get red eyes, and like, when I mean like red eyes, I mean like, ouch, and like, except for me, like, when I sleep with my contacts in, like, if you do it like once in a while, it's like, oops, I forgot to, oh well, oh darn, oh well, that's okay, whatever, it's not a big deal, but like, if you sleep in them, like, every single night, like me, don't do that, because eventually, your eyes will hurt, and if your eyes keep hurting like that, you will go blind, and I'm not exaggerating, that's what the lady told me, and then I stopped for a long time, but then I kept doing it again, and so now I just accepted the fact that one day, I'm gonna go blind, so... Just watch me, I'll be blind at 21. <laughs> but anyway, um, also another thing that you don't want to do is um, overuse your contacts. You're supposed to, regular contacts, you're supposed to use, like, use different ones every two to three weeks. And listen to that, please, because that will also help with your eyes not being so red and sore and everything like that. I mean, if you do four weeks, well, that's okay, because I think it's okay. But don't be like me and be poor. And, I mean, if you're poor, well, then, like, if you are if you don't have that amount of money, then I would stick it out maybe for, like, five weeks and then just really, really give your contacts, like, a good moisture and cleaning and use special contact lens eye drops like these. This is, like, clear the Clear Eyes brand. You're going to want this in the morning, even if you don't sleep with your contacts in, or if you if you do everything right, you're still going to need these, because sometimes your eyes just dry out. 
it just happens I don't know why don't be like me and leave your contacts like for months and months and months at a time because that's really bad for your eyes and it really is like I've gotten so much blinder like I am so blind like seriously I'm so blind but um another thing uh what you're gonna want to do um for your contacts you you're gonna want to get and you'll get this with your first contacts whatever you'll get like a big old thing but um is the uh something like this like contact solution this is the after free replenish contact solution this is like the best solution you'll ever get like i think this is like it's like number one kind of thing i really really like this solution but i don't really have money Ooh money to buy this I just got this for free from Walmart um so yeah like just you could go with the equate kind it works just as good from Walmart or uh, I got this aqua soft stuff or bio soft stuff for my contacts what is there a bunny in my yard what the heck is going on there are so many bunnies in this nail trailer park seriously nailer park they're always hopping around. It's like, oh, there's a bunny. Oh, there's another one. Oh, there's another one. Oh, there's another one right down the street. Why are there so many bunnies? They, like, multiply. Multiply like crazy. I always get so close to the camera when I'm talking. Hi. How are you? Um, another tippity dippity do. Um... Yeah, contact solution. Um, another thing you're going to want to need, but you'll get this with any contacts that you buy. I bought some of my own little contact carrying cases. Sorry, I got them in my little purse here. Look it, I got gum. Uh -huh. You're jealous. Oh god, so. Sorry. I'll take this out for you. So you're gonna want like these. I bought these from Dollar Tree cause, cause they're pink and purple and I like these two colors. Um, they're little contact carrying cases. Uh, you usually get these if you buy something like this in like a bigger bottle or even if you buy contacts itself cause they usually give it to them. Especially uh, if you're, it's your first contacts stuff then they'll give you a whole bunch of free stuff so it works really good. Or if you buy them through 1-800-CONTACTS they give you a bunch of like free solution and stuff. It's really cool. Like your first time and stuff. I'm not sure if they do that the second time, but it's really cool. Uh, but I got these two pink ones, pink and purple ones, because they're so adorable, and yeah, that's pretty much it. So that's what you carry your contacts in. By the way, you should take them out every night if I didn't make that clear enough. By the way, guys, you know that I have glasses, obviously, because I wore them in my one tutorial for glasses, and also, I, um, I have contacts, so obviously I have glasses. So one day out of the week, at least one day, and I don't do this as enough as I probably should, like on Saturday or something like that, you're sleeping, you're not really doing anything, maybe you're going out at night, but take your contacts out for the day and just use your glasses. You don't really need them if you're not doing anything around the house and just, you know what I mean? Just give your eyes a break. You're going to want to need that, like, really, 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 really bad. When you're giving your eyes a break, it's just going to bring the moisture back into your eyeballs, and you're going to feel so much better, trust me. And so, yeah. Um, and if you guys want uh, to me show you how you take them out and put them in, I'm not really going to take them out or put them in. I'm just going to show you, like, the technique, like, the where you put your fingers and everything like that, and then you'll, you'll understand. Okay. So I'm going to get really close up into the camera, like up in your face, up in your grill. Okay, so anyway, sorry. Um, what you're going to want to do is what I do. Ouch, sorry, this is so uncomfortable. Uh, you just want to take this hand, if like for this eye, take it and pull your eyelid up like this, like in the middle of your eye, and pull up like that. And then take this other hand, take your middle finger, or this finger, would, yeah, take the, take your middle finger, actually, pull this down, take your two fingers right here, and then you can just pinch to take it out. Or, if you're putting it in, just do that same exact thing, down, and then take 
your contact should be on your pointer finger and then just plop it on in. And I'll actually tell you some different techniques to get it in your eye better if it still hurts after you put it in. Like if there's still little bubbles in it, I'll actually tell you that after I'm done with that. And just the same thing for this. Up. Pointer, I mean middle finger down. And this is the same arm that I use for this one. Middle finger down. Take it and take these two pinch your fingers, otherwise plop it on in. Simple as that, guys. Other techniques, things you can do, like if there's still bubbles in your eye, you can like take your middle finger or two fingers, whatever, and just lightly press on the lid of your eye to get the bubbles out of your contacts. And it works really, 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 really well, I think. And also, a good technique is to, okay, so let's say like you're taking your contact out again, you're going to do the same thing, except what you're going to want to do is look up, look down, look side, look other side, and just keep doing that, up, down, uh, side, other side. It's really, really, really easy, and that'll actually help like re position it onto your eyeball so it actually works really really good that's another tip that the people when I first started learning um, how to put contacts in told me so it's actually a really really good tip so yeah guys um, I think I told you all that you really need to know about contacts and if there's anything else um, you can like surely like inbox me or if you really want me to make another video I probably could um, or just comment down below or something like that in that regards or whatever you know what I mean I have a Facebook page if you want to check that out that's uh, I, I'll have a link in the bottom bar it's Coley's crush on makeup just like my channel name so yeah so um, if you want to like that ch uh, page I'll have some stuff up there I only have two likes on it right now also like my Twitter it's Coley's crush that's just Coley's crush and uh, I'll have that link down below too yeah guys I hope you guys like this little thing majigger um tell me if you guys like this thing and if you have any more comments questions concerns also give me some more uh, requests because I need some more and I'm sorry I didn't have a video up for so long but now I do and I'm probably gonna help hopefully upload another one after this but I'm not 100% sure but uh, yeah guys hope you guys like this little context 101 video and tell me if you do comment down below subscribe 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 and yeah guys bye I am doing a video. I'm sorry. What do you have in your nose? It's black. Probably resin. It's on your nose.